Hello everyone, uh, and welcome to our Sons of the Forest Survival Guide. We're talking Teleport Altar today, even though I can't use it yet, but we're, we're, we're going to talk about it because it's pretty exciting. So yes, you can teleport in Sons of the Forest. You just need to find all of the artifact pieces, and then you also need the Teleport Altar, which we are going to be making today. So if you want to get it, uh, the, the recipe for the altar, you're going to need to come to this location, which will align ourselves north here it's very uh it's, it's it's basically south you'll kind of when you get when you approach this area there will be like a little blue question mark it's from the gps marker uh for one of the um uh friends here so you know take a look for uh keep an eye out for that and then uh you'll want to in terms of like i guess like landmarks look for like that little lake these little ponds a road that leads to that pond as well as the mountain the kind of half circle mountain below you and you'll know you're in the right area especially if you come here and you see this camp that has all these like dead demons hanging around and then like you know dead soldiers and stuff you're gonna need to go to the cave which is right here we're gonna head down here uh and i'll just also say this is also the location for the night vision goggles so if you still haven't found them those um you know go ahead and and take a look because they are there at last again i mean it's not like they ever stay in one place but you know okay so once you come down to the cave uh you're gonna head to the right there are like uh, kind of two pathways but we're gonna go to the right and we'll find the blueprint right here next to this body there's also plenty of sulfite here if you need to mine it which i mean if you want to use the teleporter you're definitely going to want to uh, mine some of this guy so we're gonna go ahead and pick this up there it is and um as you can see to build it you'll need eight skulls 50 bones and then 33 stones so we're gonna go back to base i'm gonna just quick pause here because it's a long journey back to base and we'll kind of go into this a little bit more all right we have made it back to base now i put my altar uh, out here and i actually need to move it because this is honestly not a great location for it but this is what it looks like we do have fully built it and we'll just kind of just so you guys can see what it looks like this is uh what uh what we're looking at here um and again eight skulls 50 bones and 33 stones to make it it's a little bit expensive uh but i feel like this is kind of like i mean you could definitely make it early in the game but by the point that you know maybe you're ready to use this i'm pretty sure it's going to be easy for you to to have 50 bones if you don't have 50 bones already goodness knows i'm always under attack here so <laughs> this is not too hard to to get this so how this works is that when you have a uh, fully assembled artifact you got to put one solo fight uh within the artifact and then when you use it you have the the, the uh the the um ability to choose to teleport and what happens is you'll basically teleport right here right inside this little thing so it's a great way to um uh, basically make your way back home at your base anytime you want um i did that on purpose just fyi because <laughs> I'm, I'm remaking this but um uh, so like that's a it's, it's basically uh, what you do and, and you can uh you know you could put it at a base. You could put it, you know, somewhere where you teleport often, you know, wherever that might be. Uh, and then when you do the artifact um, and you teleport, that's where you're going to land. So, and it even works when you are inside of a cave. So if you're in a cave and you're like about to die or something and you need to just like have an emergency exit, you can use the artifact to spawn uh, in where, you know, wherever the altar is from the cave. You just need to make sure that you have at least one solophyte inside the artifact so not a bad idea to, to have some solify on you in case you you know you do run into an emergency so uh but that is it and then like honestly i love the teleporter altar because like i said you could be halfway across the map and then boom you're back at your base within like a second so uh a great way to you know maybe get some like resource or get an item or something and then not spend all that time running back home so uh, i have to clean this up and go make it uh somewhere else i've probably somewhere within my actual uh, walls of safety um uh but yeah that's about it so thanks so much for got uh thanks so much for watching i will see you the next one until then keep surviving and keep thriving